nursing sample exam questions and answers. You have five seconds to answer each question. You can post your scores in the comments section below. Are you ready? Toilet training begins at A9 months, B10 months, C18 months, D24 months. Answer C18 months. Loss of body part or mutilation is a common fear in this age group. A infancy or 0 to 1 year, B toddler or 1 to 3 years, C preschooler or 3 to 6 years, D schooler 6 to 12 years. Answer C preschooler or 3 to 6 years. Competitive play is common in this age group. A. Infancy or 0 to 1 year B. Toddler or 1 to 3 years C. Preschooler or 3 to 6 years D. Schooler or 6 to 12 years Answer D. Schooler or 6 to 12 years What is a common complication of Addison's disease? A. Dehydration B. Bleeding C. Shock D. Peripheral Neuritis Answer C. Shock Mental retardation is a common complication of A. Phenylketonuria B. Preeclampsia C. Lyme's disease D. Meningitis Answer A. Phenylketonuria A therapeutic diet for a patient with Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder or ADHD is A. High Fluid B. High Calorie High Protein C. Gluten Free D. Finger Foods Answer D. Finger Foods a therapeutic diet for a patient with diverticulosis is A. High fluid B. High calorie high protein C. High residue with no seeds D. Low protein Answer C. High residue with no seeds a therapeutic diet for a patient with hepatic encephalopathy is A. High fluid B. High calorie high protein C. Finger foods D. Low protein Answer D. Low protein What is the appropriate positioning in a patient with dumping syndrome? A. High Fowlers B. Supine After Meals C. Leaning Forward D. Side Lying Answer B. Supine After Meals To prevent reflux of stomach contents, upright position after meals is the appropriate positioning in a patient with this condition. A. High Talernia B. Epistaxis C. Hip Surgery D. Laminectomy Answer A. Hiatal Urnia The therapeutic dose of the drug Theodor or Theophylline is A. 1 to 5 micrograms per ml B. 10 to 20 micrograms per ml C. 25 to 35 micrograms per ml D. 0.5 to 2 micrograms per ml Answer B. 10 to 20 micrograms per ml Sickle cell anemia and hypertension are common in A. Asians B. Jewish C. Whites the Africans Answer 
the Africans. Asterixis or flapping tremors is a unique manifestation in A. Lyme's disease B. Meningitis C. Parkinson's disease D. Hepatic encephalopathy Answer D. Hepatic encephalopathy Buffalo hump which is an accumulation of fat on the back, is a manifestation of patients with A. Hypertension B. Cushing's disease C. Systemic lupus erythematosus D. Hypocalcemia Answer B. Cushing's disease Cogwheel rigidity or slowness of voluntary movement and speech is caused by A. Bronchitis B. Hodgkin's disease C. Parkinson's disease D. Pyelonephritis Answer C. Parkinson's disease Hematuria or blood in the urine is the most common presenting symptom in A. Bladder cancer B. Diverticulitis C. Hemorrhoids D. Peptic ulcer Answer A. Bladder cancer Fine hand tremors is caused by A. Hepatic encephalopathy B. Hyperthyroidism C. Lithium toxicity D. Parkinson's disease Answer B. Hyperthyroidism Which of the following manifestations is typical in a patient with hypothyroidism? A. Tinnitus B. Fine hand tremors C. Facial edema D. Nystagmus Answer C. Facial edema Which of the following is a characteristic symptom of a patient with benign prostatic hypertrophy? A. Enuresis B. Nocturia C. Menorrhagia D. Melina Answer B. Nocturia Which of the following symptoms will show that a child with type 1 diabetes mellitus is hyperglycemic? A. Cosmos breathing B. Midriasis C. Murmurs D. Hunger Answer A. Cosmos breathing a patient with coarctation of the aorta will have A. Presence of leg pulses B. High BP in lower extremities C. High BP in both extremities D. Lower BP in the lower extremities Answer D. Lower BP in the lower extremities which of the following is a sign of hepatic coma? A. Hand flapping B. Hyperactivity C. Unexplained weight loss D. Easy fatigability Answer A. Hand flapping Which is a sign of hyperthyroidism? A. Sensitive to cold B. Weight gain C. Hyperactivity D. Hiccups Answer C. Hyperactivity A patient with facial twitching and hand tremors is most likely manifesting A. Schwastek sign B. Icterus C. Singultus D. Homan sign
Answer A. Shavostek sign. Which of the following is a symptom of retinal detachment? A. Flashing of lights and visual field loss. B. Eye pain. C. Jaundice. D. Headache. Answer A. Flashing of lights and visual field loss. Ritalin is best given to a child with Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder or ADHD at which of the following times? A. Before breakfast B. After breakfast C. At least 6 hours before bedtime D. During midday Answer C. At least 6 hours before bedtime a patient has urinary tract infection. His urine should be assessed for A. Glucose B. Viscosity C. Bacteria D. Blood Answer A. Glucose After bronchoscopy, the nurse should A. Feed the patient immediately B. Keep the patient NPO until the gag reflex returns. C. Keep the patient NPO for 30 minutes. D. Discharge the patient immediately. Answer B. Keep the patient NPO until the gag reflex returns. Which of the following types of lochia or postpartum vaginal discharge can be observed in a 7th day postpartum patient? A. Alba B. Serosa C. Rubra D. Non Answer B. Serosa Tonometry is a test for a. Detecting hearing loss B. Assessing organs and bones C. Detecting cataract D. Determining intraocular pressure Answer D. Determining intraocular pressure Which of the following drugs should a nurse make available to counteract potential magnesium toxicity in a patient receiving magnesium sulfate during labor. A. Lovastatin or Mevacor B. Oxytocin or Pitocin C. Lithium Carbonate D. Calcium Gluconate Answer D. Calcium Gluconate what side effect should the nurse carefully monitor in a patient taking cefoxetin sodium? A. High blood pressure B. High intracranial pressure C. Infection D. Rash Answer D. Rash A potential side effect of methergin is a. Constipation B. Hypertension C. Depression D. Hyperkalemia Answer B. Hypertension Morphine sulfate is administered to a patient who has pulmonary edema in order to A. Prevent meningitis B. Diminish venous return to the heart C. Relieve pain D. Increase urine output Answer B. Diminish venous return to the heart Neomycin sulfate is administered preoperatively to patients for abdominal colostomy resection to A. Promote healing B. Reduce the normal flora of the intestine C. Reduce duodenal ulcer occurrence D. Relieve pain
Answer B. Reduce the normal flora of the intestine. Papaverin HCL or Pavabid is indicated A. To decrease blood pressure B. To decrease urinary output C. Reduce cerebral edema D. For peripheral ischemia associated with arterial spasm Answer D. For peripheral ischemia associated with arterial spasm to prevent recurrence of rheumatic heart disease, penicillin is given to a patient A. For 3 weeks B. For a month C. Every other month D. Indefinitely Answer D. Indefinitely A patient is receiving oxytocin for induction of labor. It is essential for the nurse to monitor a. Heart rate B. T3 C. Cervical changes and BP D. Signs of bleeding Answer C. Cervical changes and BP Which of the following patients should receive pneumococcal vaccine or pneumovax? A. A 67-year-old with COPD B. A 1-year-old with sickle cell anemia C. Any patient D. A 17-year-old with diabetes mellitus Answer A. A 67-year-old with COPD Methocarbamol or Robaxin is given to a patient with intervertebral disc herniation to A. Suppress the appetite B. Decrease hyperactivity C. Decrease anxiety D. Decrease the spasm Answer D. Decrease the spasm A patient was prescribed with Timolol malleate or Timoptic eye drops. The nurse should instruct the patient to instill the eye drops A. At the lateral canthus B. At the inner canthus C. At the sclera D. In the conjunctival sac Answer D. In the conjunctival sac A patient is taking tofranil. Before giving the medication, it is important that the nurse A. Advise the patient to take it with meals B. Warns the patient for increased appetite C. Take the patient's blood pressure D. Does not monitor heart rate Answer C. Take the patient's blood pressure A patient states, I am a bird, you know, among all confused working fly. This is an example of a. Flight of ideas B. Word salad C. Associative looseness D. Delusion Answer B. Word salad A fixed false belief that cannot be corrected by logical reasoning is A. A. Delusion B. Philosophy C. Projection D. Imagination Answer A. Delusion Before administering MMR vaccine to a 12-month-old child, the nurse should assess for an allergy to A. Eggs B. Milk C. Nuts D. Cheese Answer A. Eggs A newborn receives vitamin K or aquamephiton to A. Prevent confusion B. Prevent atasia C. Prevent bleeding problems 
they prevent lethargy. Answer C. Prevent bleeding problems. Which of the following drugs is best taken with meals? A. Bactrim B. Dalmain C. Tagamet D. Valium Answer C. Tagamet Which drug is best taken before meals? A. Haldol B. MAOI C. Atropine sulfate D. Thorazine Answer, C. Atropine sulfate. A patient with schizophrenia is having auditory hallucinations. The medication prescribed is A. Risperidone B. Tegretol C. Haldol D. Lithium Answer, C. Haldol In comparison to patients with anorexia, the patient with bulimia tends to be A. More depressed B. More obsessive-compulsive C. More irritable D. Heavier Answer B. More obsessive compulsive. What's your score? You can post it now in the comment section. If this sample test has helped or inspired you, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.